Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 8 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about send order confirmation email. So let's see how can we send order confirmation email. So first of all, let's create a new mail uh, for order confirmation. So switch to the command prompt and here for creating the new mail, just type here the command php artisan make call and mail a space mail name uh, let's say mail name is order mail all right now press enter mail created now switch to the project and uh, just go inside the app directory then mail and from here let's open this one order mail.php file and inside this file just go inside the class and uh, here let's create an object of order so right here public uh, model name order then dollar order okay and inside the constructor just right here dollar this arrow order is equal to and uh, inside the constructor just pass here order dollar order okay and here simply right here dollar order all right now inside the build method uh, first of all just write here dollar this arrow add the subject and inside the subject right here order confirmation okay this is the mail subject now arrow view and add here the directory name mails and view name uh, let's say view name is order dash mail okay now let's create this view so copy this and go to the resources directory and here uh, resources directory then views and inside this views directory let's create a new folder here and folder name mails okay and inside this mails directory let's create a new file and file name order dash mail dot date dot php all right now open this file and inside this file uh, first uh, first of all let's add here the boot uh, html5 boilerplate so just write here exclamation sign and press tab all right now add here the, add here the title um, order confirmation All right, now here um, let's add here the p tag and just add here the text hi and display the customer name here. So uh, just write here dollar order arrow first name. Okay, then a space dollar order arrow last name. Okay, and after this just Add here the p tag and uh, write a message here your order has been successfully placed okay and after this add premium br tag and now add here the table the style uh, with the let's say with 600 pixel then text align right okay and uh, inside this table let's display here the order item order item okay so first add here t head then tr add here the column name so right here th product image okay image and now copy this and paste here three times and change here the column name which is name product name then quantity and uh, here price okay and after this just add here t body then write here the at the rate for each directive for each okay then dollar order arrow 
order items okay order items edge dollar item all right now close here in for each and inside this for each just add here tr tag then display here the product image product name quantity and price okay so right here td double curly bracket dollar uh, for displaying the image add here the imc tag src is equal to double curly bracket then asset and here just pass here the product directory path okay so right here assets slash images slash products and after this add a forward slash then dollar item arrow product arrow image okay I'll also add here the image width so right here width is equal to 100 pixel and just close this image tag okay now for displaying the name add here double curly bracket dollar item arrow product product arrow name now let's copy this and paste here two time and change here the name quantity so right here or item arrow quantity okay small q and then price so for price uh, just right here item arrow price okay then uh, multiply with quantity so let's copy this and write here asterisk sign then yes item arrow quantity okay and also add here the dollar dollar sign all right now uh, after the for each let's add here the tr tag and uh, display here the order summary okay subtotal tax shipping and totals okay so here just add td then cold span uh, 3 and now add another td here and uh, here display the subtotal so right here dollar double curly bracket dollar order arrow subtotal okay and now let's copy this and paste here three time uh, here just write the text and here uh, tags here and uh, here display the shipping so simply write here place shipping and here total okay you can also add here the text subtotal and here tags okay then shipping and here total all right now uh, set here the font size so inside this td just write here the style font font size is equal to uh, 15 pixel and also add here the font weight bold font weight bold okay now let's copy this and paste inside the tags and for the shipping 
and also for the total for total just increase the font size so write here 22 pixel okay and also inside this tr inside this uh, just right here add here the border okay border top one pixel solid and let's add here the color this one okay and let's copy this and uh, also add the, the style inside this td all right okay now it's done so after this uh, okay it's okay now save this file now let's open the checkout uh, component class file so just go inside the app directory then http liveware and uh, from here let's open this one checkout component.php file and uh, inside this file you can see here this is the method for place order okay now let's create another function for sending the order uh, order confirmation mail okay so after this i'm just creating here the new function public function and function name uh, let's say function name is send order confirmation mail okay and inside this just pass one argument which is order and inside this just write your mail okay and also import here the mail like this use illuminate support facade slash mail okay now inside this function just write here mail colon colon to and uh, add here the customer mail so write here order arrow email okay then send and inside this just uh, pass here new order mail object okay new order mail this one okay and inside this just pass here the order and also import here order mail so on the top just right here like this okay use app mail slash order mail all right now inside the place order function let's call this function so uh, you can see here this is the place order function function okay so after here okay just closing the before it uh, just closing the just before the closing uh, curly bracket okay here after this and before this curly bracket just write here dollar this arrow send order confirmation mail okay and inside this just pass here dollar id as dollar order okay now save this file now everything is done and uh, one more thing uh, make sure you have configured the mail uh, inside the dot env file you can see here this is the dot env file and here i have already done this mail configuration all right so close this file and uh, all all done so let's check this so, uh, first of all run the application so just write here php artisan serve okay all right now switch to the browser and just refresh the page all right now let's add some product to the cart so let's add okay add to cart add more product add this one okay now three product inside the cart okay so let's check out so click on checkout all right let's log in with user credentials right here user email id and password click on login all right click on cart now uh, okay click on checkout add uh, and here let's add here the billing address so 
just write here the first name, last name, email address, this one, okay, and phone number, address, line one, line two, country, uh, provenance, province, and uh, then town, add here the zip code, pin code, all right. And now choose the payment method. I am just going to choose here the cash on delivery. Okay, now let's click on plus order now. All right, order placed. Now let's check the email. So go to the email and uh, just refresh the email. And you can see here the order confirmation mail okay so just click on this email link and here you can see hi and this is the customer name your order has been placed successfully and these are the ordered item details okay this uh, this is the these are the products name quantity and price okay and here is the subtotal tax shipping and total price all right and here you can see uh, product image uh, images are not showing here because this time this uh, project is uh, project is on local host okay after deployment this project on live server product image will be displayed here okay so in this way you can send order confirmation email to the customer so that's all about uh, project uh, uh, send order confirmation uh, email okay so thanks for watching this video and uh, if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching